Hey guys, so welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in today's video, I thought we could do a what's on my iPad. Um, so yeah, I have the iPad Air and I have been obsessed with it. I used to like never know like what to use it for or like just like what I could get out of it. And I do have like a MacBook, so yeah, and I've always like used my MacBook, but lately I have become an iPad girly and I freaking love it and I'm obsessed. So yeah, I thought I could show you guys everything I have on it. So yeah, let's get into it. Okay, so I have this, um, it's kind of like blue grayish um, iPad case from Amazon. I can link it down below. I love it. Oh, I used to have like this other one before, but the pen holder was like on this side, so it would never charge. But this one's amazing because it's on this side, so it's like always charging. So I freaking love that, but yeah, now let's get into the iPad. Okay, so first we have this wallpaper. I took this when I went to Sunrise, obviously, but I don't know when it was, but I love this picture. It's so cute and just so simple, and yeah, I just love it. So now let's get into it. So this is my first page. I have my like emails here. I have my red ones here just because, I don't know, I feel like it's more clean and it's just like not showing all of my emails. So whenever I get an email, it'll go up there because it's like on red ones. Then on the right, I have my notes app. Um, yeah, I like use notes. I freaking love my notes app. So yeah, that's that. Then I have clock. I feel like I don't really use this, but I don't know, I just like put it there. I don't know why. And then below that, I have both of my uh, batteries, my iPad one and my pencil, which like I said before, this case is amazing because it's like always charging my pencil. And before it would be dead all the time, which was so frustrating because if I would put it on this side, like it would just fall obviously. So, um, but yeah, I love this case. And then moving on, I have the weather app. I feel like I don't really go on this that often because I just like usually look it up on my phone. But yeah, I still have it. I don't know why it's not loading. Um, but yeah, then below that, I have this like picture that I took at St. Croix. And yeah, I just love it. It's so cute. And yeah, then I have the calendar app. I don't really put much on here anymore because I just use GoodNotes instead. But I like having it there. Then I have FaceTime, which I'm not going to go in because yeah, obvious reasons. Then I have settings. Um, I don't really do much on here, but I do have the iPad Air if you were wondering. I was trying to figure that out. But then I have photos. Um, yeah, I feel like I'm looking at getting a lot of photos on here, but it's usually like videos I have to edit or stuff I have to do on my iPad. So I have to like airdrop it from my phone to my iPad. Um, then I have this productivity folder, which is voice memos, pages, iMovie, files, Calculator, find my friends, maps, and camera, which are all self-explanatory, so I'm not really going to go into it. But then, oh, also, I didn't talk about my wallpaper. My wallpaper is just, like, a simple one from Pinterest. I could also link down my Pinterest down below, so you guys can go check it out. And if you want wallpaper, that is very simple. You can have it. And, yeah, I can also upload my lock screen if you guys want to. But, yeah, so moving on, down below, like, in the bottom, I have messages, which... I'm not really going to go into because I don't want you guys reading my messages, but that's that. Then I have Safari, which is also very self-explanatory. I do use it a lot lately. But yeah, then I have Spotify, and I love playing music on my iPad or connecting it to my speaker, like, from my iPad so I can still use my phone. So yeah, I've been, like, loving that. Then I have emails, which I'm also not going to open because you guys are nosy. But yeah, it's just also self-explanatory and notes, which I already showed you, which was at the top. And moving on to the next screen, I have this, like, widget from... I think it's like the Widget Smith app and it just has the, the day, the date, and yeah, it's really cute, very simple. And then on the right, I have my to-do list, which is also synced to my computer and my phone, which I love. And it's honestly so helpful because I have it on my phone too, like on my main screen. So it's like always there, so I always see what I have to do and like just get stuff done. Um, but yeah, I have that. Then on the left, I have these like bunch of pictures. The first one with the sun I actually got on Pinterest and then the quote I also got on Pinterest and like I said I'm going to link it down below so you guys can go check that out if you want it. Um, and then the bottom two pictures are actually pictures that I took and just added them to the widget smith. And then on the right side next to that I have YouTube which I've actually been obsessed with lately and yeah I was actually talking to my friend about it how like I feel like a lot of people stopped making YouTube videos and it's just like I don't know why because I love watching them and then once I watch them, I'm like, I have to make a YouTube video. So that's where I'm now. And obviously, you guys are on my YouTube channel. But this is my YouTube channel. And 
yeah i'm trying to be on the grind nowadays and i have notion which if you guys don't have notion you need notion in your life it is amazing i don't really use it for a lot of things but i do use it for brand deals and i just like love it, it helps me like stay organized and i can put like the like the brand de like the name of the brand i can put the price and then what i have to do for them which honestly helps me stay so organized i used to do this on my notes app but it wasn't as like organized and this is just like very satisfying to like complete and stuff so i love doing that and i have a bunch of other things but i haven't really used it for that uh see so i have like my week thing oh that i can put stuff but i haven't used it in a while but yeah it's so cute and there's just so much to do so honestly like if you figure it out like it's so fun and definitely a way to stay organized and if you struggle to stay organized like me like this is super helpful um but then i have pinterest i haven't been on pinterest in a while but yeah i always like love it and i feel like when i'm bored or something i just like love going on here and looking for inspo and stuff and then i have good notes i love good notes i have let me show you guys all of my notebooks i have like four classes that i'm taking right now and they're obviously all on here and then i have my to-do list my weekly look social media monthly planner like journaling it just helps me stay super organized and like i said if you know me you know i'm really bad at that so this is very helpful and it's kind of crazy because i've always been like a pen and paper kind of girl but after discovering my ipad and all the fun things it can do i have been obsessed with my ipad so i don't need more pen and paper i need like my ipad 24 7 so yeah but moving on um i have this like random folder it has canva which i do all of my thumbnails on there and when i have to do like invoices for brands i like do it through canva then i have paypal which is where i get paid when i do brand deals um then i have airbnb i have booked a couple airbnbs on there but i don't really use it as much but i just like having it there then i have amazon which i have been obsessed with lately and it's been a problem because i've been spending so much money on it but yeah, I also have an Amazon storefront, which I can also link down below for you guys to check out. And then I have Goodreads. I actually have been lacking on my reading, but I'm about to finish Malibu Rising. I think that's what it's called. And I like love it. It's a very like chill, like, I don't know. I feel like I'm not like hooked on it, but I've been like liking it and enjoying it. And I'm gonna be done with it soon. So if you guys have any book recommendations please let me know because i love reading and i want to really get back into it then i have mercari i sell some of my clothes on there and i usually buy like random things on there when i don't need anything um but yeah it's kind of like ebay like um depop like one of those then i have espn my boyfriend plays football and i had to get espn and i had to pay for it monthly so i could watch his games but it's okay, I love watching his games and they're so fun. So yeah, I have it on my iPad because I feel like I'd rather watch it on my iPad than watch it on my phone. So yeah, then I have We Sponsored. That is a like an app for brand deals and stuff, which I don't use it all as often, but I enjoy it and I just have it on my iPad here. Then I have social media. I honestly don't even go on Instagram on my iPad because I just rather go on my phone. Like I don't like the, oh, Bella's calling me. But then I have um, Instagram, which I don't really use on my iPad because I'd rather just go on my phone. And yeah, I don't know. I just I just enjoy it more on my phone. Then I have YouTube Studio, which helps me like track all of my content and stuff, and like um, how many views it gets and all that stuff. So yeah, it's very interesting and like very fun to like look into that and see like I don't know what people like like watching and like what they're like more interested in um but yeah then i have visco i honestly haven't even logged it oh yes i have actually oh stop this is so cute i haven't used this in so long i actually used to be obsessed with visco and then i just randomly stopped using it but like i might be making a comeback because this is so cute um this is my visco if you guys are interested in following me because i'm about to start posting more often on here because it's so cute then I have TikTok. I don't watch TikTok on my iPad either. Like, I feel like I'm either, like, doing, like, stuff for, like, content creation or YouTube or, like, school, which TikTok isn't either, like, neither of those. Because if I'm going to make a TikTok, I'll just do it on my phone. Then I have Hulu. I've actually been obsessed with Hulu the past, like, couple nights. I've been just watching um, New Girl. It was on Netflix originally, and then they took it off. So Hulu has been my go-to. Then I have Kindle. I don't really use Kindle on my iPad either. I have like an actual Kindle, so I'll either read there 
and need be like i'll use my phone i don't really use my ipad for that and i have netflix i don't really use netflix on here either unless like i'm not watching you and want to watch something else i'll go on netflix and see what they have but yeah um i don't know it depends like depending on my mood sometimes at night i'll watch sam and cat which i love to like fall asleep um uh, but yeah that's sad enough prime video i don't use prime video on here either but i'm definitely down to check it out and see if they have any like good movies or shows or anything um but yeah that's sad enough cap cut i edit all of my youtube videos on here and sometimes my brand deals i don't this sounds so crazy and a lot of people think i'm crazy for this but i literally just like film them on tiktok and edit them on tiktok just it's easier for me and like i'll actually get it done because if i do it somewhere else like i was gonna forget about it but sometimes when i'm really on my grind and like want to make it really cute i'll use CapCut. and then for my youtube videos i'll sometimes use imovie when it's like a super long video and then transfer it to CapCut and like do the final edits but the last video i actually did on CapCut on my ipad and i loved it so i'm probably gonna like edit this video on CapCut. and then i have canvas that is for school i'm taking a couple classes for business so yeah that's that it like shows me all my classes and like homework i have to get done and stuff then below on the left i have a picture of my family it's me my dad my sister and my mom um at graduation so i'm actually doing the second degree and yeah i don't know it's super exciting and i just love this picture it's so cute and i feel like we don't get like a lot of like pictures like the four of us as a family like that often so i just love that picture and we all look so cute then I have on the right a picture of me and Davion in Jamaica. We went there for my birthday and I don't know, I just love this picture. We took it at sunset and yeah, it's like giving good vibes, you know? And then below that I have this photo and video folder which is Procreate, Photo Retouch, Airbrush, and Lightroom. I also do not edit my pictures on my iPad. I'd rather just do it on my phone. I just think it's easier and yeah, I just enjoy it more so... I don't really use any of these unless I like really have to um, but yeah just like having them here just in case and then I have a school folder which is Sheets, Docs, Zoom, Word, Drive, Excel, and Gmail. Um, I also do not use these. I'd rather like for Google Docs and Google Sheets and stuff I'd rather use my computer. Sometimes I do use Zoom when I have to like do meetings and stuff and I don't want to use my computer um, but yeah I don't really use these as much and Gmail I use it on my phone usually just because it's easier. But yeah, that is all I have on my iPad. I literally have been obsessed with everything this iPad can do. I literally like barely use my computer. Sometimes I like use it just to like send emails because I don't have a keyboard for this. So it's definitely like way easier to send emails and like write stuff up on my computer. But other than that, like I love my iPad and I've been just obsessed with it. Like I don't think I've ever used something as much as my iPad and I don't know it's so helpful to like especially like since I'm so like disorganized and stuff like writing my like weekly look like my daily like schedule like what I have to get done like what's due in the month like all this stuff like I just love it and it's so easy and I don't need to be like having like five different notebooks like it's all in good notes which I love um but yeah that is everything i hope you guys enjoyed if you guys have any other questions anything you want me to link but yeah if you guys have like any other videos you guys want me to make like let me know because i want to be on my youtube grind again like i love this and it's just so fun to me and yeah i don't know that's it but i hope you guys enjoyed please make sure to like and subscribe i will see you guys next video today's thursday and i think i want to vlog tomorrow because i don't know i'm gonna have like a little fun day but yeah, I will keep you posted on that. But that's it for my iPad. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you next time. Bye. Love ya.